Hello, everybody. This is Robert. I'm from Cloud Sigma. I'm the CEO and co-founder. And just in this really short video, I'm going to show you how you can easily purchase private networks for your infrastructure within our cloud. Just to know, um, you can have multiple private networks on the server. And also, um, each private network is a completely encapsulated network for your computing. And you can pass any kind of traffic within that. You can set up custom routing as well. And like I said, um, you can do multicast traffic, broadcast, you know, and any kind of traffic that you might want. It's a virtual wire implementation. So this is my account um, just on the dashboard. So I'll go to networking and then VLANs, which are the private networks. And then you can see I've already got four VLANs. I'm just gonna show you how you can quickly create another one. <clears throat> so we'll just go purchase a VLAN. Um, we'll start now. Well, yeah, that's fine. Now it's fine. And we'll just buy it for a month and you can set it to auto renew. So then it will just keep renewing and, and let, you can turn that off later whenever you want. So I just purchased that. It's going to confirm the cost. And that's now in my account. So if I go back, you'll now see that I have five private networks available. So I can now start adding my servers to those networks. So if I go in and I'll take uh, this one called tutorial, which I just set up earlier, we can go into the network tab and you can see here that it's got a public network with a dynamic IP address, but um, I can, let's say I want this to be a private server. I don't actually want it to have public internet connectivity. I can actually just remove that public network and then I can add um, a private network. So I've got my choice of five there, so I can just choose this one, which is the one I just bought and save it. And that's literally ready. So that virtual machine now, when it boots up, will see a networking card and a network, which is the private network here um, for this VLAN. And actually I could go ahead and add two private networks um, if I have some sort of segmented networking set up. Save that. And again, it's that simple. Um, and finally, imagine this was a gateway server. We might actually want public internet connectivity. What we can do is we can go and go in, you know, assign a static IP address, even have a networking policy that might lock down access to, for example, your specific uh, office address or whatever it might be. Um, and then you can save that and that's ready. So now that server has three different networks available, as you can see, uh, one of which is a public network with a static IP and two private networks. So you can build very um, sophisticated networking setups easily and quickly within, uh, within the Cloud Sigma Cloud. So that's it. I hope that was useful um, and we look forward to seeing you soon on our cloud.